there, Nitwits. Welcome back to Nittany Draws. I'm Nittany, and this is the show where I go and show you my artistic process, talk about life as a woman, life as an artist, and what it's like being both of those together. Today, I have the very last of my artist trading cards for the artist trading card swap I'm doing with the Creative Arts Collaboration, which, of course, soon you'll absolutely get to see the entire haul of all of the pieces that I got in return for these. But what an artist trading card swap is, which I guess I never really explained, is that I make six pieces of art, a bunch of other people make six pieces of art, they mail them all to me, I make little packs of art and then send them back out into the world, and then I get six pieces of art that are from different artists that have participated. So at the end of it, I end up with a bunch of different artwork from different people, which is always fun because I love original art. My whole house is covered in it wherever I can get it. My best friends are all artists. And so generally speaking, I tend to cherish my original art pieces and of course my prints and everything. Anytime I can get some artwork from somebody, I am super, super thrilled. So that is what I am doing. This one actually turned out to be one of my favorites, even though about halfway through, I was ready to completely throw in the towel on this piece. Um, it was super frustrating because I screwed up. Uh, <laughs> I won't show it yet, but you'll see it soon and you'll know it as soon as it happens because there's this moment of like, oh shit, what did I just do? And it's just so frustrating when that happens because I was so excited about this piece. I was like, it's turning out so cute. She's like kind of hippy dippy sort of thing. She's supposed to be like blowing a, a dandelion and then the seeds are going to explode everywhere. That was the concept of the piece. But then things went terribly awry. So I don't know if that actually came across. So here it is. You see it? Can you tell? Yeah. I smeared the ink in the background everywhere. I didn't know what to do to hide it. Like I, I was too impatient to sit back and relax and just like color around it. So I scribbled over the top of it, which caused all of my line art to smear. So I had to get uh, creative. Um, I ended up taking some uh, white cotton ball colored acrylic paint, dabbing it on my finger and turning everything into clouds. And it covered the whole thing right up. You can't even tell, which I am super, super proud of because I straight up was like, no, what am I going to do? So yeah. Anyway, guys, I hope you like what you saw here today. If you did, please hit the subscribe button and the like button. Each like helps build the Knitwit army a little bit stronger, helps my videos get into more hands, and tells me how I'm doing. If you'd like to see more of what is going on in the Knitney universe, head on over to knitneys.com where you will find galleries of my finished pieces, blog posts about my life as a YouTuber and an artist, and a link to my shop where you can find all the Knitney merch your little heart desires. I update the shop every Friday, so there's always something new to find over there. Join my newsletter to get coupons and the inside scoop once a month. I promise I won't spam you. Cross my heart. Hope to die. Stick a needle in my eye. Anyway, Knitwits, have a great day. Thank Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next Saturday.